Hey, I'm headed back from Texas. I just looked at three tracks this morning uh, with Brandon White down there. and I'm going to put his number on the screen here. You'll see it in a minute. Uh, he's going to be the guy that you're going to want to call if you've got any interest in these three properties. They're all going to be, uh, they're all for sale now. They're all going to be on our website really soon, so the world's going to know. But I wanted to talk to you, talk about it for a minute while they were uh, fresh in my mind. I, I walked on them this morning and got pictures of them. Um, we've got maps. We've got everything ready to go. They're just not on the website yet. Uh, all three of these tracks are in Jasper County, Texas. Uh, the first one is 20 acres in Kirbyville. Kirbyville is south of Jasper. They're off Highway 96. And uh, it's just outside of town. It's on a blacktop road just outside of Kirbyville, just east of Kirbyville. And uh, I call it the cemetery track because it borders the Kirbyville Cemetery. So, uh, but, so it'd be a real quiet neighborhood. So there you go. I had to, I'm sorry, that's bad humor. But it's a heavily wooded track. Um, it's got a lot of small pine and hardwood on it. Uh, real pretty track. We had it under a lot of it, a good bit of it underbrush, so you can see it real well and walk it pretty good. And it's, uh, it's you know, so it's got utilities, blacktop frontage. Um, it's, of course, again, one side of it joins the cemetery, so there's no, there'll be nothing going on on that side of you in terms of uh, development or anything like that. And uh, it, it's going to be, it's a cool little track. You'll like it. It'll be a great rural home site there, just on the edge of town. Uh, the second track is a little north of there in the Roganville area. It's a 29 acre pine plantation. It's probably, I don't know, it's probably uh, 12, 13 years old. It's not quite ready for a first thinning. It's going to be real close. Another uh, couple of years, uh, it'll be long enough to get, get all of it on a truck and you, a man could get, you know, a good first thinning income on that track. We've had a, had a, a, a little trail mulched from one from the county road all the way to the back end of the track there to the creek so that it can, you can walk it really well and see it. It's a great stand, great stand of, uh, of pine, just not quite ready for a first standing, but getting real close. Uh, it's a gravel county road uh, and it's it's got a, uh, I know it's got a high fence neighbor on one side. Um, so it's it's a good quiet little neighborhood there and it's gonna make a nice rural home site So it's a uh, 20 acres Kirbyville 29 acres Roganville and the last track I looked at this morning that I, I actually walked uh, it's a, uh, Let's call it 80 acres. It's about 78 79 acres There in the Holly Springs area uh, which is east of Jasper off of uh, highway 190 um, this track is going to be a great little hunting track it's got uh, uh surrounded by timberland it's got a uh, it'll have a 30 foot deeded easement to the property off a of blacktop you know farm to market road of course and it, it, it's got a, 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 a it's already had the, the pines had a second thinning on it so it's in that final stage of just putting on wood you know for saw timber and so uh, somebody be able to have a you know good pine income off that track in the next five six seven years uh, be able to have a nice recreational hunting track. It's got roads along the edge, one one edge and through it. So it's got some decent access in the track as well as legal access to the track. So you're going to want to check those out. If you've got any interest in uh, rural property in that, kind of, that part of Texas, Jasper County, that 20 acre, the 29 acre and the, the 80 acre, 79, 80 acre track there. And uh, you can just call Brandon White. He's got all the maps, pictures. I've got some drone footage of some of it. These are all be on the website here pretty quick, but if you've got some interest now, you can kind of get a head start on them. We've also got a number of other listings in that Jasper, Newton, Tyler, Hardin County, Sabine, St. Augustine County areas there that Brandon will be able to tell you about. A lot of them are already on our website, recland.net, but if there are a lot of them coming and Brandon, and I have got all this mapped out already, so he'll be able to send you good information even on the tracks that we don't have listed yet. We've got a bunch of them uh, brewing and just about ready to go out. But these three tracks I just wanted to tell you about while it was fresh in my mind and, uh, and give you a, a, an idea of some really cool small acreage uh, rural tracks that, that you might have some interest in. So give Brandon a call or check out 
excuse me, check out our website at recland.net. Bye.